Stephanie Davis has announced she and partner Joe McElroy are expecting their first child together, a baby boy due next year. The former Hollyoaks and Corey star, 31, who already shares seven-year-old son Cabin with ex and former CBB star Jeremy McConnell, revealed her fertility journey had been a roller coaster after suffering a devastating miscarriage in 2021. Stephanie explained the couple had been trying to conceive for two years and were even exploring IVF before falling pregnant naturally. Telling OK, I did the pregnancy test at my mother-in-law's. I could not believe it. I've done a million tests over the past two years and videoed them, the one time I didn't, it was positive. She went on to recall how she and Joe, who she met in a group therapy session in 2021, were left, sobbing, after a scan revealed they were accepting a baby boy. Joe never cries, so when he started that set me off. We were just sobbing on each other. Then the nurse in the room started crying, too. Stephanie said that Cabin is also ready for the role of big brother and is already telling his mom how to sit in a bit not to squash the baby. Recalling telling him the news during a family holiday, she said, he was adorable. We took a video, and it's so cute watching a little seven-year-old process that he's getting a sibling. He points at me and goes, is that why you've got a lump in your tummy? It was just beautiful, the three of us on the beach. Stephanie Davis revealed in 2022 that she and Joe had suffered a miscarriage, three weeks into a previously unannounced pregnancy. Taking to Instagram with an emotional post, saying she woke up one morning and didn't feel pregnant anymore. Writing, I didn't want to post about this until I was ready, I don't think I ever will be or anyone is who goes through this but here goes. So as my beautiful followers a lot of you had asked if I was pregnant a while back when I wasn't on the rides at Southport and you also noticed a lot of things, well you were right, we were having a baby. I was pregnant, we found out from so, so early on it felt like we were pregnant for so long. If you remember I came off social media for a while, it was because we had a miscarriage. I was nearly nearly 12 weeks pregnant, 3 months. I had sickness from early on, bad, bad sickness lol I was so nauseous and vomiting, and crazy hormones so it felt a long time with our baby. I started getting really bad headaches one night and the next morning I woke up and I said to Joe and my mum and Joe's mum that I didn't feel pregnant anymore, they know how I am and thought I was overly worrying and the baby would be fine as on our previous scans the baby's heartbeat was beating beautifully. But as a mum I guess you just know. Stephanie went on to explain that she and Joe are heartbroken following the miscarriage, saying she thought everything was okay after passing the 12-week mark. The anxiety, the heartbreak and the sadness we have gone through was horrendous. Me and Joe were so excited and already had visioned and planned a life with our family of four. I was already looking at what I was doing for my baby shower. You think when you get further on like I was that everything will be okay, so it was a big shock. When they told us there was no heartbeat anymore I don't really remember much after that just totally heartbroken. The TV star said she had to be rushed into hospital for an operation and heartbreakingly said she felt numb and empty after the surgery. She added, I had to have an operation to have our baby removed as was further on, I couldn't have got though it all without my absolute rock, Joe. My mum, Joe's mum, Jane, and Kath were amazing, and our families and my management's support. After the operation I was so numb and empty and my hormones were all over the place. It was hard to accept there was nothing there anymore and our journey we were on was over. Joe was my rock and I love you more every day. Stephanie embarked on a turbulent relationship with Caleb's dad Jeremy during their time on Celebrity Big Brother in January 2016. Their on-off relationship resulted in public spats, domestic violence and a consequential three-year restraining order. Jeremy was charged for domestic violence in August 2017 after being accused of assaulting Stephanie in a drug-fueled row and was sentenced to 20 weeks in prison suspended for 12 months and 200 hours community service. Thank you for tuning in to Express Insights News. We hope you found today's news informative and engaging.
If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to stay updated with our latest content. Also, hit the bell icon to receive notifications every time we upload a new video. We value your opinions and would love to hear your thoughts on today's stories, so feel free to leave a comment below. For more updates and behind-the-scenes content, follow us on Express Insights News. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on Express Insights News. Stay informed and stay safe.